Greetings, ladies and gentle players. It's another wonderful Friday. It's October of 2023, making it a wonderful day for basics. And this month, though I do want to keep things simple, I do want to keep things basic, I think I'm going to try to focus on, dare I say it, some scary moves. Moves that are fine, but you know what is typically a little bit uncomfortable to play, whether it's going to be invasions, whether it's going to be an uncomfortable pincer, you don't know why you want to play it. I don't, I don't know what it's going to be yet, because I, I can't decide what my opponent's going to play. But I'm going to play a range of games, I'm going to look for some scary moves that are okay to play, but make people, maybe people feel a little uncomfortable playing them. See if we can play them. Le jeu a commencé. Okay. I will start with a 3-3, three, three, uh, the 4-4 four, four here, sorry. Okay, okay. Mmm. Diagonal. There we go. That's a first scary move. Diagonal play. Like, what are we going to do in a diagonal game? I don't know. Um. The approaches have more variation to them. We'll do that, too. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so getting a base here is fine. Diagonal's a little bit slow. So I will also... Um... Enclose, why not? All these are fine moves. Hmm... What else do we have? We could answer locally. But there's a corner still up, so we could, we could play over there too! But it means leaving our stone behind. What's going to happen to it? Is it going to die? Maybe. Bam. Hey, jumping out a little bit too. Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. We're not doing that. Yeah, we ain't doing that. Block wrong direction. Weird, but okay. Hmm. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that, look at that, look at that move. I get to go ahead now. And take the extension off of this wall. Grabbing my own. I like it. Um... Mm, kind of want to go back here and play this one. But, okay. He's approaching, I'm going to respond. He's approaching, I will respond. Um... How though? Kick him to a jump up, I guess? It's not bad. Eh, uh, sure, fine. I'll, I'll, I'll do a kick into a little jumper. Wablam! And all of this has so far been following opening theory. Right? Little slow. Stone can't be killed one more move. Taking a big move first. He followed up. Three on one. This is more of a mid game thing we respond to now. So, once again, play it away. Hmm. What do you think? Cap it? I'm thinking cap it. What are you thinking? I'll, I'll, I'll simple. I'll follow up. I'll follow up. Follow up. Bam. Okay. And again. Hmm, I mean, that's pretty... I got I got shape now. I'm, like, alive, right? We got, like, eye here. Got, like, a little eye shaper doodle uh, over there. So just don't be surrounded, right? Or follow up our move. Or enclose. Or enclose. Oh, there's so many good options here. I'll take the enclosure. Literally last corner of board. Bam. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. I have no reason to defend, like, anything here. So, now we're in mid-game. I'll defend the weakest group on the board, which is now mine. We're in mid-game. So, we can go ahead and do that. So, wablam. Now, the game is looking a little bit more complicated than usual because of, like, uh, some of the choices that we've been making. 
But if we take it one step at a time, we don't like try to get too greedy. Just keep an idea on like what the next big thing is. We're going to be fine. Like right now, I'm not about to YOLO a move over in here. It's like, no, 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 no. First, I'm going to play this one. And then I'm going to make a shape point. Right? Simple. Now we're out, and I've also got like an eye up here, so I, I could play away and really take advantage of them. I'm going to play one more move here. You definitely do not have to. You could absolutely be like, okay, now I'm going to play over in here. And he's probably going to play here, and I'm going to cap, and he's probably going to retreat. And then I'm going to just take something over in here, because I think I'm ahead at that point, you know? Okay, that one. Three space, leave it. I'll leave a three space behind. I'll take my two. reason why I am playing here, however, is because, you know, Go is called a surrounding game. If I played away and he did this, it's like, well, that kind of feels like Sente, right? Because I'm about to lose uh, some stuff in the corner now, too. Like, that's, that sucks. I don't want, I don't want that. I don't want to, like, have to worry about this kind of stuff, right? Uh, kick it to pincer? No, I'll, I'll do a solid defense here. I'm fully surrounded here, which is why I did not kick. Because if I do this, right, it's not bad, but there's, like, some 3 3 odds you there still, you know? I mean, I'm sure it's fine. It's fine. Now, incoming my favorite move. Bam! Reason being... Low stone, low stone, low stone. I would usually attach the, the middle stone to see uh, how I can keep the low stones all nice and low. Just get force and moves, you know? Nice and force and moves. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, honey. That's a spicy meatball. Okie dokie. Uh... Well, Hane into Hane is usually what I would recommend for Sentai. But what's the value of that, you might ask yourself? Well, the top group's not actually alive right now. So if I get some middle influence, I can go ahead and be like, would you blam? And then he, he can't live locally here anymore. He's got to run away, but I've already got the influence, so he can't run away. There's nowhere to run to, you know? Like, I want to play it, but it's a, it's a little, it's a little much, I'll admit. I'll just go ahead and Hane here and see what he does. I'll just Hane back and see what he does. This will give me forcing moves. Let's just see. Let's see what's what. Okay. Yep. Got to fix, or I'm gonna kill some stones. So how are we fixing? How are we fixing? How how are we fixing? I might just get some influence here and then cap him, get him to live locally here, and then just build something in the middle, rather than you know do a co. Oh. Hmm. Okay. I advise ka ha 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 shin. Last attempt. Sir, why do you think cutting points are things that other people have to worry about? You got one, two, three of them. I can take whichever one I want, and there's nothing you can do about it. <sighs> Is it time he learned the error of his ways? Is it secret? Is it safe? Tell you what. Last time. Absolutely last time. Please defend or I'm cutting you to pieces. I mean, I actually don't mind. Play move over in here. I'm still making a big middle, right? It's not, it's not a big deal. He realizes that he's not alive locally, but I guess I get to kill the stone, which is pretty nice, to be honest. I will take it, thank you.
That way I, get, I keep uh, some points. Ooh, hello. What is your name, Mr. Pokey? I'm Mr. Pokey. I'm a barrel of fun. I'm Mr. Pokey. Don't try to run. Let's see, what are we going to do? I'm thinking just take that middle area, right? That's looking that's looking fine. We're going to take it. Bam. Okay. Four lines of territory is pretty good. Are you going to cut me? Mm-hmm. Well, that might get him killed. Because there's nowhere to go. Also, if he surrounds this other group of his, then that's probably a death sentence. Because, like, yeah, right now, where is he going? He can't go right. He can't go up. He can't go down. And last time I checked, he's not going left. So where is he going? So where is he going? Where is this guy going? There's nowhere to go. I am sorry to report that there's nowhere to run to. You are mine now. Nothing but dreams, White. Nothing but dreams. Cause yeah, the cutting point was weird. Like, how was that? How? Where? Where was he gonna go? What was he gonna do? You know? It's it's a little. It was a little strange. It was a little bit strange. Now maybe, maybe there's a defect in my shape. We'll have to. We'll have to wait and see. I guess, see if I can do a little sente stuff? Oh, that kills him. Son of a biscuit. If I play here, he's dead two different ways. I, I won't do it. But yeah, if I connect there, I didn't even notice he was he was killing himself there. Because here into here, right? And then if he plays here, there's there. And then that's just not enough room to live. Right? That's rude. Can you, like, not try to kill me? I wasn't trying to kill you. Is the story I'm going with. If anyone asks, chat. It was like there, like that when we got here. Now, I want to kill this, or keep this killed, rather, without having to go back and exploit the fact that the top dies if I connect. I, I don't want that being my out. It's interesting that the shape he created does allow for that kind of thing, but I, I, I don't want that to be the reason why we're okay here, you know? It's like, oh, no, don't worry, we're fine, because the top is dead. No, we were focusing on this. Let's focus on this. Um, I think we're okay. I admit it's getting a little spicy. I'm not above killing the top if things go badly here. I just don't want to do it. That wasn't the plan, you see. If I play here... He plays there. I can't go here, here, into here, can I? What if I play this one, then? Uh, the answer is still no, you idiot. Huh. Well. As I previously mentioned. <sighs> oh, God. As I previously mentioned, I did not want to do it. But it looks like it is going to be my out. Like, I don't want to turn around and kill this. 
but I'm turning around and killing it. Wait, maybe this defense was the wrong move. Because I was already alive up here. Yeah, I bet that's the one that that uh, screwed up a little bit, I eh? There, there, there. No, I can't do anything there. Can't do anything there, Sag. It's fine. <sighs> Sub yet. I am not happy that that is dead, but it is dead. It is very unfortunate, very unfortunate indeed. But it's okay. This is why you're flexible and go. This is why you gotta be flexible, like it or not. Just the way it is. Actually no, before you don't, Make a misread here and let this silly group live. But hey, as long as you got plan B, you're all right. I think the real downside here for him is... I think the real downside here for him is uh, he has to defend that too. Début du passage en revue. All right, so he resigned. Um... This is apparently wrong. I needed to play this one instead, it looks like. Hmm. Reverts. Reverts, reverts, reverts. Hum, 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 de hum, de hum, de hum. No. That move is really annoying. I don't see a way to defend it. Yeah, I don't see a way to defend it. This would work. This one... bit tougher. Yeah, I don't see how to defend all of that. It looks like this move was just the wrong one. And we should have just gone ahead and played this one instead. Because he can go ahead and do whatever he wants here. Like, that's fine. If he wants to kill the top, he can kill the top. Actually, he can't kill the top, can he? He has to play here. Well, he might be able to kill the top. Let's say, let's say that's dead. Let's say that's dead. Let's say that's dead. It's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. That's dead. Problem is, this group is now going to be in trouble. He has to like go ahead and defend that. And then even after he plays there, there's still this one. Because this group's also in trouble. Either way. Either way, it's fine. I like how the opening went. I like how the opening went. They were a little bit more unusual moves because they weren't as solid. But opening theory still allows for them. But don't take my word for it. Here's performance report. Opening has got nice little 80% accuracy. So we're good. It does not mind that I enclosed. Uh, does not mind that I played elsewhere. It doesn't like the 3-3. Three, three. It wants me to jump out. Are you serious? Oh, more complicated. Jump out and then fall at the top. Eh, no thank you. I vote. I vote no on that one. Thank you. Yeah, I vote. I, I vote. I'm going to vote no. 
I know it didn't like the cut, the, the kick. It always likes this one better. A little bit more, a little bit more uh, complicated. So I don't, I don't, I don't like that particularly much. But yeah, overall, not bad. Overall, not bad. At this point, it's also kind of important to note, I guess, that I've got a ninety percent uh, win rate. Uh, here, because the position is just more favorable for black than white. Like, this group is, as as we saw later, not doing very good. This, as the game still wants, cut off because both groups are, they get, get cut off, are in a lot of trouble. So it's just way easier to handle this position for uh, black than it is for white. That's why... That's uh, pretty much good for the entire game until, until this, right? And now because I didn't press for the kill, uh, things got bad. Things got bad. Wants to press for the kill, I'm trying not to do that, and things just turn very, very gross. Either way, cool game. Hope you liked, and I'll see you next time for uh, some more scary games in basics.